some decent weapons, but what I really want are some de is some decent armor. Uh, that's what I'm looking for. So it looks like the armor scales up as time goes on. Um, I also need some new midi midi gel. Pretty badly. Let's just go through here. Make sure we're not missing anything. Oh good, there's a second level. Got a bad feeling about this. I'm gonna switch to a shotguns. There we go. Now now we can actually get some new stuff. Alright, yes, 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 new armor. Taking it. Okay, let's finally get Stalin Shepard equipped with some better armor. Uh, what do I want? I can give him there's this Explorer V. There we go, even though that looks kinda gay. Correct the new armor, I can also give you some new armor. Oh never mind, it's you need light armor. Yeah, I'm not liking the look of this new uh use this thing again? Come on, dude. Come on. I'm reading that the torch is offline. Was that you? Can you hear me? Who are you? What's going on? My name's Kate Bowman. I'm an engineer. I was part of the team assigned to bring this asteroid to Terra Nova. We were attacked yesterday by Batarian extremists. I've been hiding since they arrived. I think they know the torch went out. Why are they doing this? I don't know. But if this asteroid isn't slowed, millions of people on Terra Nova are going to die. If I find out anything, I'll... I've got to go. Good luck. Cool. Okay, I'm going to check my journal. See if, uh... Oops, wrong one. I meant my codex. I want to see who these Batarians are. In the early 2160s, there they go. the Alliance began aggressive colonization of worlds in the Skillian Verge, much to the dismay of the Batarians, who had been developing the region for several decades. In 2171, the Batarians petitioned the Council to declare the Verge a zone of Batarian interest. The Council refused, however, declaring unsettled worlds in the region open to human colonization. In protest, the Batarians closed their Citadel Embassy, and severed official diplomatic relations with the Council, effectively becoming a rogue state. They instigated a proxy war in the Verge by funneling money and weapons to criminal organizations, urging them to strike at human colonies. Hostilities peaked with the Skillian Blitz of 2176, an attack on the human capital of Elysium by Batarian-funded pirates and slavers. In 2178, the Alliance retaliated with a crushing assault on the moon of Torfin, long used as a staging base by Batarian-backed criminals. In the aftermath, the Batarians retreated into their own systems and are now rarely seen in Citadel space. Well, there you go. That's who the Batarians are. And I, I had no idea of them myself, so... I'm happy to have learned. Gambr come on. Sorry, I know this is being kind of slow. This is why I don't like to... Okay, what's this other armor I have? Oh, this is way better. There we go. That, that looks much nicer than that other crappy armor. Oh no, what's going on here? Hey. Hey. Oh god. I didn't mean to... Are you hurt? You can't go firing your weapon at everything that moves. What the hell's wrong with you? Sorry. I thought you were one of them. Here's a tip. Two eyes, human. Four eyes, Batarian. Yeah, okay. I'll remember that. I know you're scared, but I'm here to help. Commander Shepard, with the Alliance. Simon. Simon Atwell. I'm the chief engineer on this rock. Listen, we don't have much time. The Batarians fired up the fusion torches. You've got to shut them down before we hit Terra Nova. 
There are four million people down there, Shepard. I... My family. They live in Aronis. My kids and grandkids. Nice communities. Good schools. I don't have time to do the math in my head. What happens if we don't stop this rot? <laughs> X-57 is 22 kilometers long, twice the size of the asteroid that wiped out the Earth's dinosaurs. It would be like millions of fusion bombs striking at once. Millions. The heat of the blast. A thousand kilometers away, clothes will ignite. There'll be global wildfires. Air shock will flatten everything for hundreds of kilometers. Terra Nova will die, Shepard. Not just our colony. The planet. There'll be a climate shift, mass extinctions. The ecosystem won't recover for thousands of years. Millions, maybe. I guess Vitarians are as bad as they say. I've heard all the stories. Slave rings ranching people like animals. Pirate bands burning colonies to the ground. But this is... The Citadel Conventions forbid asteroid drops. I never thought the Batarians would go this far. The Conventions only apply to Council-aligned races. The Batarian government is a rogue state. The Batarians aren't stupid. If they made a policy of this, the Council would declare war on them. My opinion? These guys aren't backed by their government. They've got to be working on their own. If the Batarians can't keep their own crazies in line, we'll do it for them. I just don't want the Terra Firma party using a threat to my home as an excuse to invade somebody else's. Batarians everywhere, and I need to shut down all three torches. Anything else I should know? One of the torches is surrounded by live blasting caps. We were set up to excavate when we arrived at Terra Nova. I rigged them with proximity detectors. That tank of yours will set them off, so you'll have to go in on foot. Even then, they'll explode if you get too close. Just go slow and easy. You should be fine. Should I requisition a cow to walk through ahead of me? <laughs> Look, you can disable them, just not remotely. I didn't have the equipment to set it up differently. There are manual controls by the entrance to the torch facility inside the blast zone. You can disarm the caps there. One last thing. I had a crew working off-site when the attack hit. I'm worried about them. These Batarians are ruthless. I saw them smash the faceplates of guys working vacuum. And those Varen. I don't think they always wait for a corpse before feeding. Four and a half million people are gonna die in a few hours. Don't make me trot out some tired platitude about the needs of many versus few. But if you see them while... No. You're right. Focus on the torches. Sorry. Damn straight. There were a bunch of engineers over at the main facility, but they're probably all dead. That are being held hostage by the Batarians. Time's running short. I better get moving. I think I'll make myself scarce in case any Batarians come back. Good luck, Shepard. Alright, let's save some people. But not before being assholes to them. Kinda like House in that way. So, do we shut this off? See, where's the map? Three torches. I'm pretty sure I shut down this one. It's not blasting smoke and shit anymore. Uh, next place, right over here. Let's roll, ladies and gentlemen. Woo okay, I'll stop that. I think I'm going the entirely wrong way. Fortunately, this thing can climb up 90 degree angles, so it's okay. Yeah, I'm just totally not going the right way. I'm probably taking the most inefficient and awkward way towards this, uh, this blowtorch or whatever it is. Yeah, I'm going right over the mountains. Whoa! You hear me? I'm getting all kinds of interference. Damn. Sorry. There's a lot of feedback. Let's see if I can fix it. In the meantime, just keep doing whatever. Man, if I were in that maker right now, I would probably be throwing up. I'm guessing this is the one surrounded by blasting caps. Probably uh, get rid of these uh, these here. Shit! Why did I fire from somewhere? Oh, right there. Morning. 
ground penetrating radar detects anti vehicle demolitions nearby. Proceed on foot. Yeah, let's get out, guys. Let's move, move, move. Negative contact. Oh, jeez. Holy shit. Okay, maybe I should have taken out those turrets first. That was probably a terrible idea, whatever it was that I did. <laughs> 